Ready? What is it? Saw it? No. Merry Christmas! Oh! That's what it is? I got you this. Really? Yeah, look. How did you know I wanted this? Wow. Thank you. Ooh! If it's good. Yeah. Does it look cool? Mm -hmm. It looks cooler than the other one? Yeah. The one from Walmart? The one from Walmart. <laughs> this is cool. I like it. Yay. Thank you. And it came perfect timing for the drift event. Just send it. 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 So I'm doing a quick cleanup on the rear fenders because the previous owner just cut and folded them. So you want to make sure that you seal off the quarter panel because a lot of moisture and especially smoke when you're drifting is going to go into the cabin and you don't really want that. So I'm going to go ahead and, or well I already started, I'm over here cleaning it up and welding up the folds. Uh, this is half already done, I already cut it and as you can see this is the other half that I'm almost done. Um, in the meantime, we have a package that just got delivered. It's actually the new over fenders. So we're gonna go ahead and open that and show you guys a test fit on this quarter panel as well. Let me go ahead and just finish this and we'll get on to unboxing that. Just finishing up on the fender, got it all cleaned up. I'm gonna paint it, but I'm on a tight crunch right now, so I'm gonna go ahead and open up the box. Ready? Oh, it's hard. <laughs> this side. Ready? Yeah. Oh wow, that is so good.
you see that person that keeps commenting, who's paying for all this? Oh no. They said it more than once? Yeah. You guys want to know who's paying for this? Me and Christine are. We work very hard for things that we got. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and put this on the car. I'll put it on the Let's test fit it. What? Oh. Is this for this, this for car? A coupe. This is for a coupe, huh? <laughs> yeah? Yeah. Did you buy that one for the coupe? I bought one for a hatchback. This is for a coupe, huh? That looks like it's for a coupe because the, the back goes so high. Oh, unless it's supposed to be down here. Yeah, it's supposed to be down here. Uh oh. Yeah. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> That's so weird. It goes straight like that? Yeah. That's cool. But I just think that sucks because that means I gotta clean up, take off all these holes. This is for sure though not gonna be wide enough for the wheel. Really? Yeah, now that I'm looking at it. I mean, if we bow it out, it probably looks good, it, but it's for sure. Bow it out a lot. Oh, uh, because you have to run zero camber. Probably just gonna rivet it in. Oh yeah, you're not drifting this car anymore. So I won't have to worry about repairing fenders and stuff. Don't even act. I'm sorry. It's part of drifting. Oh. <laughs> hey! Sorry. Should I try again? One more time. Yeah, I'm probably gonna have to make this bolt out in order to fit these wheels. I'm debating if I'm gonna run 30s, uh, not 30s, 35 sidewall instead of a 40 sidewall on these wheels. I'm probably gonna have to add just a tad bit of camber. I was really gonna go for the, I wanted to go for the no camber in the rear, but I might have to add a little bit of camber just to get these to fit and uh, bolt out these fenders a little bit just to get these wheels to fit. But yeah, we'll figure that out later. I just want to do a rough test fit for now. So uh, I guess this is part one and we'll get back to you guys with part two.